Hi everyone, I'm Elijah Jadi. Welcome to Music Greatness. This is your band, and for today's lesson, we have Loose by Daniel Caesar. It sounds just like this. Okay, what I just played was the first part of the verse, and we're playing here in the key of D flat. In the key of D flat major. And what I'm going to break down in this first part is the main chord progression of the song. But you're going to see later on in the section that we're going to slightly change the progression, especially in the voicings. So, we have first a D flat major 9 chord. Octave D flat on the left, F, A flat, C, and E flat. Then we're going up on A flat minor, A flat minor 7, A flat and G flat, B, E flat, and A flat. Then G flat major 7, Octave G flat, B flat, D flat, and F. After that, we're going up a fourth, playing off key with B7, B and G flat, A, E flat, and G flat. Back in the key of D flat, we're playing F minor 7 after that, octave F, A flat, C, and E flat. Going up a fourth once again. Now playing B flat 7. B flat and A flat, D and B flat. Let's continue. E flat minor 9, octave E flat, G flat, B flat, D flat, and F on top. So we have the minor 3rd, the 5th, the 7th, and the 9th up here. And coming at the end of the chord progression, we're playing A flat 7, flat 9. A flat and G flat, A, C, and E flat. Okay, perfect. Let's quickly recap. We have D flat major 9. Then A flat minor 7. Sorry. After that, G flat major 7, B7, F minor 7, B flat 7, E flat minor 9, and A flat 7 with a flat 9. Okay, remember that we're going to use that chord progression, but we're going to change it with the voicings. We're starting like this. So, I played D flat major 9, 
then a changed C to B. And now I'm playing D flat 9. Then I played one D flat using my right hand, going up directly on G flat, but playing it as a G flat 6 chord. G flat and E flat, playing G flat, B flat, and D flat on my right hand. Then keeping the same notes on my left, I'm going to take down the measure third on my right hand and play A. Okay, so G flat 6 and then G flat minus 6. Directly after that, play F minus 7. And then I'm going to go up on B flat 7, but before doing that, we're playing this melody line. I played B flat, A flat, E flat and then B flat 7 using B flat and A flat with D on my right hand. And then I'm going to continue with again B flat, A flat, G flat, F. And now I'm playing E flat minor 9. So still holding on F, I'm going to complete and play octave E flat. G flat, B flat, and D flat, right hand. Then one D flat, going up on A flat 7, flat 9. And finishing here. Play F, going up on G flat. Okay, once again. So, I forgot to mention, but after playing G flat 6, then G flat minus 6, play one E flat on the right hand. Okay, perfect. Let's continue. Okay, now we have again D flat major 9. And after that, we're playing A flat minor 7. Then play one E flat on your right hand and use this passing chord. I'm playing G and F with B and D flat. And then I'm going to land on G flat major 7 after that. Continue. After that, we're playing B7, like so. Then play one A flat, just before playing F minor 7. And then we have B flat 7, playing the full chord with D and B flat on the right. Then A flat, 
G flat, landing on E flat minor 9. Going up a fourth, on A flat 7, flat 9, add 13. So playing A, C, and F, right hand. Then play E flat, so the fifth. Just like that. Once again. Okay, let's recap and replay the entire first part of the verse at full speed. And that's all for this first part. For the rest of the song, please head over to musicgreatness.com. As always, thank you for watching. If you love the content, leave a like, leave a comment, and also don't forget to subscribe. Until then, see you guys next week for another Eurobeat.